Hi, I'm Justin Bruns, technician at One Energy, and I'm doing this week's technician talk, and we're gonna be talking about visual inspections on high voltage gloves and uh, why we do them. So we're gonna reference uh, ASTM F496 for all the visual inspection of gloves. So we definitely wanna follow all those steps and uh, definitely follow your uh, company's uh, safety policy for sure. Um, so we just wanna check for pinholes. One single pinhole can be a matter of, you know, you going home to your family at the end of the day. Um, so that's definitely very important. Uh, we use these gloves for working on high voltage. Uh, these larger gloves are rated for uh, 35,000 volts, working on that. And then these are for uh, 15 kV systems. And they tell you on each glove, there should be a stamp here on what it was tested at. So these were tested at 40,000 volts uh, for the, uh, the 36,000 volt glove here. And then these were tested for 20,000 volts and they're good for uh, 17,000 volts. So just to start out, uh, we wanna make sure that we look at the stamp date. Uh, they should be tested yearly and then uh, they should be within six months of being in service. So for like these, for instance, uh, we just took these out of the bag. They're stamped March 10th, 2021. So seeing, seeing how we were after six months of, Mar of the March date, but we just took, just took them out of the bag, just put them in service. So technically we're still good until the March 10th of 2022 for these gloves. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and kind of roll these up, do a nice air test on them first, make sure we don't get any leaking air coming out of them, and then go ahead and do a nice visual inspection in between all the fingers. Make sure there's you know, no discoloration, doesn't look like there's any chemicals or anything on them, um, any hard spots or real soft spots, weak spots, any little, um, little frays or anything, no foreign objects in them. And then we're gonna go ahead and actually flip them inside out, which I've already done on this one. We're gonna go ahead and check all the same things, just in between the fingers, like all the high wear points. Everything looks really good on these ones. We actually have one here that we uh, tagged out. We actually had a pinhole in one of the fingers. So whenever we roll this one up, You can probably actually hear that air coming out and that escaping through that pinhole on that finger here. So once again, just that little pinhole, once again, can you know make or break your day and see if you get to go home and see your family or not, um, which we obviously don't want. We also wanna go ahead, check the leather protector, you know, make sure it's not saturated in any oil or grease or anything like that, any contamination. Uh, make sure it's gonna give you know, good physical protection of your gloves. Um, so then, for as far as storage goes, I'm gonna wanna go ahead and put everything in. We wanna separate the leather and the, the rubber section of the gloves. Go ahead and put everything in, opening down. Make sure no foreign objects can fall into our bag and get inside our gloves. Just like that. Close them up. Good to go. And that's it for this, and uh, thanks for watching our technician talk.